The Morning Business Report on Eyewitness News is brought to you by Access Health CT Small Business, connecting small businesses to affordable group health insurance. Connecticut leaders are encouraging shoppers to spend money at small businesses this holiday season, and the athleisure market is heating up as consumers flock to comfort in uncomfortable times. Jane King is live in New York with those stories and more. Good morning, Jane. Hi, Caitlin. Good morning to you. Yes, the athleisure market, it is very competitive, but expected to be a hot seller this holiday season with sales of about $105 billion. Now, MPD says items including sweatshirts and sweatpants and yoga pants, things like that, expected to be 31% of total U.S. apparel spending over the holidays. Now, dominant players are Lululemon, of course, Gap's Athleta, Nike, and they have reported stronger sales than other clothing companies during the pandemic. Well, Small Business Saturday is is tomorrow and it is more critical than ever for local shops. They have been among the most hurt during the pandemic. Local leaders and small business owners are encouraging Connecticut residents to support their small and local retailers during the holiday shopping season. And UPS and FedEx reportedly facing a shortage of delivery vans. A pandemic sparked shutdowns at vehicle factories. That has led to a shortage of delivery vans when everybody is shopping online and getting things delivered. Now, UPS and FedEx tell Bloomberg this probably is not going to crimp their ability to be able to deliver things on time. And stocks fell on Wednesday, except for the NASDAQ. It was higher. It is a lighter trading day, or was on Wednesday ahead of Thanksgiving. Now we expect a lighter today uh, trading day as well. The markets do close early at 1 p.m. Eastern time. So a uh, half day of trading. And ahead of that, we are a little bit higher. Live from New York, I'm Jane King. Back to you, Caitlin.